It is March the 8th, 2017. I'm on a little walk jog here and it's peaceful. Very little noise. You know, <clears throat> having peace in your life, peace of mind that is, is crucial. You can have all the money in the world, you can have all the treasures in the world, but if you don't have peace of mind, it all means nothing. At my former company, where I used to manage a group of people, I used to share with them the following little story. Maybe this will be helpful. At the beginning of the morning, I would say, take out a piece of paper and write down all your worries on that sheet of paper and put it in an envelope, put your name on it and give it to me and seal it. I'm not going to read it. <clears throat> and I would tell them, look, we're all very, very much alike. You're going to write down relationship worries, money worries, maybe job worries, health. Somebody said something about you. Maybe somebody doesn't like you, whatever. All sorts of worries. Write them all down on a sheet of paper and then hand them to me. And I told them they now have permission to give me all of those worries for the eight hour work day. And at the end of the eight hours, I would hand them their envelope and they could hand the problems. You could take the problems back on for themselves. That little exercise actually allows us to freely give those worries over to the Lord. Even if you're not a believer, which I am, write those worries down on a sheet of paper and just put them on your desk and say, at the end of the day, I'll come get them. What you'll find is those worries are not quite as strong. What you'll find is you'll start to overcome those worries one at a time as you become stronger in your walk in life. <clears throat> that little exercise has worked for me as I take a walk every day. A very good bit. A friend of mine reminded me to do this. His name's Bill and uh, lives up in Connecticut. Dear, dear, dear man. And he shared with me something that he's done for many years and that is he takes a walk in Connecticut for about an hour every morning so I'm now doing that in the morning and in the evening and uh, it's nice so I'd recommend it that is the news here from I almost said Lake Wobegon that was a <laughs> that was a Garrison Keeler used to say that I don't know if you guys remember him but he was fantastic and that's the news from Lake Wobegon I used to love him anyway that's it from North Georgia. The Lord loves you. I know you have friends who love you. Go find them. And I can tell you there's a God who loves you. Amen. Until next time, be good.